Hey, what's up, Hat Orton family? Uh, I've been talking to Melissa about funny teaching stories. This is probably my favorite teaching story. Uh, so in Korea, they call you Melissa teacher or Scott teacher or Casey teacher. Uh, in Korea, I taught at an after school school, then I taught at a university. In the same time, I was teaching at a kindergarten, you know, two or three times a week. Uh, and the kids are really adorable and cute. And I was teaching kids who were maybe five, six, seven years old. I started teaching in the winter. And then, so for some reason, sometime in the summer, you know, something changed. Uh, so in the morning, I would always say, okay, kids, how are you today? I feel happy, I would feel sad, you know, and just for some reason today, the kids say, you know, hey, gay teacher, how are you? Huh? So I've been called pretty much every single name in the book. I've never been called gay by a five-year-old, <laughs> and every kid is laughing and eating it up. I'm really confused. And this goes on for a while. I only see the kids, you know, two or three times a week, but every single day, hey, gay teacher, do you eat gay food? Gay teacher, where do you buy gay clothes? Gay teacher, do you have a gay mom and gay dad? Gay teacher, do you have a gay girlfriend? So, and they're all kind of giggling and laughing, but why do they think I'm gay? And that's funny, you know, but why, why is this stuff going on? So finally I talked to one of the, the other teachers who could speak English and they're like, they're not calling you gay. They're calling you gay. Uh, what the hell does that mean? It means dog. Well, why are they calling me dog teacher? Well, you're, now that it's summertime, they can see your arms. You've got hairy arms, so you look like a dog. <laughs> so they weren't saying I was gay. They were calling me dog teacher. Hey, dog teacher, do you have a dog mom and dog dad? Do you eat dog food? Where do you buy dog clothes? Do you have a dog girlfriend? So that's my favorite story. <laughs> I think it's adorably ridiculous. All right. I hope you guys are doing great. It's been a rough week for, I think, all of us, but I hope that made things a little bit funnier. Have a great day. Miss you guys all.